Rivastigmine, also known as Exelon Patch, transdermal 24 hours, is used to treat confusion related to Alzheimer's disease and Parkinson's disease. It does not cure these diseases, but it may improve memory, awareness, and the ability to perform daily functions by restoring the balance of natural substances in the brain. The recommended starting dose of Exelon patch is 1 4.6 mg per 24 hours patch per day. After a minimum of 4 weeks of treatment and if well tolerated, the dose should be increased to a maintenance dose of 1 9.5 mg per 24 hours patch per day. The best time to apply the patch is in the morning and should be left on for 24 hours. Remember to read the patient information leaflet before using the Exelon patch, transdermal 24 hours, and consult your doctor or pharmacist if you have any questions. You should apply the patch once daily to a clean, dry, hairless area on the back, upper arm, or chest. Remove the old patch before applying a new one, and do not wear two patches at the same time. Avoid applying the patch to red, irritated, or broken skin, and do not apply it to areas where you have applied creams or lotions. When changing your patch, apply it to a different area to prevent skin irritation. If the patch falls off before it is due to be changed, apply a new patch right away and replace it at the regularly scheduled time the next day. Do not try to reapply the old patch or use tape to keep a loose patch from falling off. Make sure to wash your hands with soap and water after each application, and if the medication comes into contact with your eyes, rinse them right away with water. The dosage is based on your medical condition and response to treatment. Your doctor will start this medication using a lower dose of the patch and may increase your dose after 4 weeks. Do not increase your dose or use this drug more often than prescribed. Use the medication regularly to get the most benefit from it, and change your patch at the same time each day to help you remember. If you do not use rivastigmine for 3 or more days in a row, talk with your doctor before starting again, as you may need to restart at a lower dose. And remember to tell your doctor if your condition worsens. Some common side effects of the Exelon patch may include nausea, vomiting, loss of appetite slash weight loss, diarrhea, weakness, dizziness, drowsiness, shakiness, tremors, and skin irritation at the application site. If these effects persist or worsen, it's important to contact your doctor or pharmacist. It's important to note that this medication has been prescribed to you because your doctor believes that the benefits outweigh the potential side effects. Many people who use this medication do not experience serious side effects. However, you should inform your doctor right away if you experience any serious side effects such as slow heartbeat, black stools, vomit that looks like coffee grounds, severe stomach-slash-abdominal pain, seizures, or trouble urinating. Seek immediate medical help if you experience fast-slash-irregular heartbeat, severe dizziness, fainting, or symptoms of a serious allergic reaction such as rash, itching-slash-swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. It's important to remember that this is not a complete list of possible side effects. If you notice any other effects, it's crucial to contact your doctor or pharmacist. If you're in the U.S., you can report side effects to the FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088 or at www.fda.gov slash medwatch. In Canada, you can report side effects to Health Canada at 1-866-234-2345. Before using Exelon patch, transdermal 24 hours, make sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies or if you are taking any other medications. This is important because the patch may contain inactive ingredients that can cause allergic reactions or other problems. Also, let your doctor or pharmacist know about your medical history, especially if you have breathing-slash-lung problems, stomach-slash-intestinal problems, heart problems, fainting, seizures, problems urinating, or liver disease. Exelon patch, transdermal 24 hours may affect the heart rhythm, so it's important to discuss any heart conditions or family history of heart problems with your doctor. Additionally, low levels of potassium or magnesium in the blood may increase the risk of heart rhythm issues, so talk to your doctor about using this medication safely. This medication may cause dizziness or drowsiness, so it's important to avoid driving or using machinery until you know how it affects you. Limiting alcoholic beverages and avoiding exposure to direct heat while wearing the patch is also recommended. If you are going to have an MRI test, be sure to inform the testing personnel that you are using the patch, as some patches may contain metals that can cause serious burns during the test. Lastly, 
If you are pregnant or breastfeeding, discuss the risks and benefits of using this medication with your doctor before starting treatment. And as always, talk to your doctor or dentist about all the products you use before having surgery. It's important to be aware of potential drug interactions that could affect how Exelon patch, transdermal 24 hours works or increase the risk of serious side effects. Make sure you keep a list of all the medications you use and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. Do not start, stop, or change the dosage of any medicines without your doctor's approval. Some products that may interact with this drug include aspirin slash nonsteroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, NSAIDs, such as ibuprofen, naproxen, metoclopramide. Be sure to carefully check the labels of all prescription and non-prescription medicines, as many medications contain pain relievers slash fever reducers, NSAIDs such as aspirin, ibuprofen, or naproxen, that, if taken together with ribostigmine, may increase your risk for stomach slash intestinal bleeding. Low-dose aspirin, as prescribed by your doctor for specific medical reasons such as heart attack or stroke prevention, should be continued. Consult your doctor or pharmacist for more details. If the Exelon patch is chewed or swallowed, it can be harmful. If someone has overdosed, the patch should be removed if possible. For serious symptoms such as passing out or trouble breathing, 911 should be called. Otherwise, a poison control center should be contacted right away. U.S. residents can call their local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222. Canadian residents can call a provincial poison control center. Symptoms of overdose may include severe or persistent nausea slash vomiting, excessive sweating, very slow heartbeat, slow or shallow breathing, and seizures. It is important to seek medical help if any of these symptoms occur. It's important not to share this medication with others. Your doctor will also need to monitor your weight periodically to check for any potential side effects. If a dose is missed, it should be taken as soon as remembered. Replace the new patch at the regularly scheduled time the next day. Do not use two patches to catch up. When you store your Exelon patch, make sure it's kept at room temperature and away from light and moisture. It's important to keep it out of the bathroom and away from children and pets. And when you no longer need it or it's expired, make sure to properly discard it. You can consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for the best way to do this. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.